Shikari Richardson has encountered a rocky start to her 2024 season with back-to-back -back defeats in the Diamond League, sparking concerns about her Olympic prospects. With sluggish performances in Xiamen and Suzhou, questions arise about her readiness for Paris and her ability to maintain the consistency needed to compete with her Jamaican rivals. Let's delve deeper into Richardson's early season struggles and what they might mean for her Olympic aspirations. In her first outing at the Xiamen Diamond League, Richardson faced defeat at the hands of 19-year-old Australian sensation Tori Lewis, finishing in underwhelming times. This setback continued in Suzhou, where she settled for third place in one of her slowest career performances. The string of disappointing results has ignited discussions among track enthusiasts, casting doubt on Richardson's form and mental fortitude compared to her dominant 2023 season. Recalling her stellar performances in 2023, Richardson's current struggles stand in stark contrast to her previous feats. From blazing times in Doha to her World Championship victory in Budapest, she once held the title of the world's fastest woman. However, her focus on the 200 meters event this year hasn't yielded the desired results, raising concerns about her preparedness for the upcoming challenges. As fans and analysts, it's natural to expect Richardson to perform at her usual high standard, given her impressive resume, including a stunning victory in the 100 meters with a time of 10.65 seconds, making her the fifth fastest woman of all time, and a bronze medal in the 200 meters at the Budapest World Championships just last year. Adding to the intrigue is the departure from Richardson's usual season opening routine. Typically, she kicks off her season with 100 meters races before transitioning to the 200 meters. However, this year's approach has been different, leading to speculation about the reasons behind this change. While some may speculate, it's crucial to consider the intricacies of an athlete's training and strategy, especially someone as seasoned as Richardson. Nevertheless, the deviation from her norm has undoubtedly fueled discussions about her form and preparedness for the Olympics. Despite the concerns, it's essential to remember that it's still early in the outdoor season, with the Olympics three months away. In the world of track and field, athletes often peak later in the season, hitting their stride at the perfect moment. Richardson and her coach are undoubtedly working diligently on addressing any technical issues and fine-tuning her performance for the trials and beyond. The upcoming Olympic trials will serve as a litmus test, revealing which athletes have what it takes to represent the United States on the grandest stage of them all, as we navigate through the uncertainties of the early season, it's vital to refrain from drawing premature conclusions about Richardson's Olympic prospects. The journey to Olympic glory is fraught with challenges and setbacks along the way are not uncommon. Instead of dwelling on the negatives, let's maintain faith in Richardson's talent, determination, and ability to rise to the occasion when it matters most. Only time will tell how her season unfolds, and until then, Let's reserve judgment and continue to support Richardson on her quest for Olympic redemption. Looking ahead, Richardson's journey to redemption hinges on her ability to peak at the right time. Trusting the process with her coach, regaining confidence, and avoiding a late-season slump are paramount as she prepares for Paris. While early-season setbacks may raise doubts, it's premature to write off Richardson's Olympic aspirations based solely on her initial performances. Every athlete encounters rough patches, but it's in these moments of adversity that true champions rise to the occasion. Rather than dismissing Richardson prematurely, let's offer encouragement and support as she works tirelessly to bounce back. While Richardson's early season struggles may be disheartening to some, let's remember that greatness is not defined by a single race or a season. With determination and dedication, Richardson has the potential to reignite her spark and reclaim her position at the top of the podium. It's essential to recognize that development and improvement take time, and Richardson is undoubtedly committed to putting in the work necessary to return to her peak form. So, to the skeptics and critics, let's refrain from writing off Richardson's journey prematurely and instead, watch with anticipation as she embarks on her path to redemption. As we come to a close, I'd like to hear from you, share your comments. What are your thoughts on Shikari Richardson's performances thus far this season? What are your predictions for her at the trials and Paris Olympics? Well, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, hit the bell to stay notified and show some love by hitting the like button. Thanks for tuning in, and remember to keep the sport spirit alive.